ABC 10 News Pinpoint Weather Super 7-Day Forecast. A lot cooler today. Yeah, much cooler. Yeah. Uh, cloud coverage pouring in now, though, for our coastal areas. So, uh, yeah, look at that from our uh, camera at Hotel Dell. Coronado, we have that cloud coverage rolling on in. If you're trying to watch the uh, clips tonight, Head inland so you can see from our satellite and radar. We do have moisture uh, pouring on in towards Southern California thanks to a coastal eddy. So yeah, any lunar eclipse watchers uh, head inland. That's going to be your place for better viewing because coastal areas uh, hit and miss low clouds. You could find some spots along the coast where it's nice viewing, but better chances are going to be inland. Don't forget uh, it's going to be in just a few hours, those evening hours. Uh, so for the next couple of days, Pretty mild as far as our forecast is concerned. Like we just said, today much cooler than yesterday. Temperatures uh, getting back down to seasonal average. Same thing into the next couple of days. Coastal area is going to continue to cool off just a tiny bit more, bringing us back to that seasonal norm. So through the day tomorrow, it'll be really pleasant. Uh, we are going to see that marine la layer influence overnight tonight, like I said. But by tomorrow afternoon, we should see mostly sunny skies. We're going to spend most of the day in the 60s along our coast, uh, eventually getting up to right around that 70. 70 degree mark. Uh, like I said, marine layer is going to return. It'll stick around for the next couple of days uh, thanks to a nice shift to more onshore flow. So same thing as we head into Tuesday morning. Any early morning risers, get ready for that. But we should see sunshine by the end of the day for the next couple of days. Cloud coverage returning at the end of the week. But temperatures, not too much fluctuation for us. We're going to be sitting right around 70 degrees for the next week uh, for uh, our coastal areas. It'll be really pleasant for us. Inland, same thing. Uh, today we saw a lot of 80s heading into tomorrow. We're going to be a little bit cooler, so upper 70s could still see some lower 80s in store for us, uh, but it'll be another really nice day. Same thing, lots of sunshine in the afternoon. We'll spend most of the day in the 70s for our inland valleys. That's much cooler than what we felt today. It'll be a nice break for you uh, in those inland communities. A little bit of a cool down continuing into Tuesday as we head into the mid 70s. We'll see some winds picking up as well for the next couple of days. Uh, Really, it's going to favor the eastern parts of our county, but breezy conditions continuing to our coast for the next few days. Uh, and then look at that temperatures. Same thing, not too much fluctuation, mostly 70s for our inland areas for the next week. For our mountains, nice and quiet as well. 70s in, on tap for the next week. Deserts, same thing. A little bit of a cool down as we head into the end of the week. So it's, it's warmer in the in the desert. Uh, heat's going to stick around a little bit longer there in the eastern parts of the county. So we're not down to the double digits until Friday and Saturday. But same thing, lots of sunshine in store. It's going to be a really nice week ahead. And so the eclipse tonight is right before 730, like 725 Yeah, it's going to be 730, 830 and then until about 9 o'clock. So that's going to be that peak eclipse okay. for us so tonight. So a, a nice window to watch that. Yeah. Be helpful. Be clear. All yeah. right. Thanks, Leah.